In a world of fake news and alternative facts, my family and friends insisted on being here tonight to make sure this was really happening. <laughs> hey, class of 2017, congratulations. And welcome to the Alumni Association. Before you leave tonight, be sure to grab the donation envelope taped under your chair. I want to thank the California State University Board of Trustees, San Francisco State President Les Wong and Vice President Robert Nava for their amazing generosity in conferring this honorary doctorate on me. I would also like to extend my congratulations to the richly deserving Dr. Johnny Mathis. I happen to think it's only appropriate that Johnny and I are receiving our honorary doctorates together since some of you were probably conceived to the sounds of his incomparable voice. While my shows provided a much needed distraction when your parents weren't talking to each other. I owe so much to San Francisco State. I had wonderful instructors like Jan Miller, Buzz Anderson, Barbara Linton, and Dr. Ben Draper, who opened the world of broadcasting to me. They inspired me and gave me the confidence to move to Los Angeles after graduation and pursue a career in television writing. And for that, I will be forever grateful. But the best thing State gave me is my wife, Rosie. Uh, if there is one wish that I have for all you graduates, it's that at some point you are lucky enough to have a great mentor, someone who can share their wisdom and guide you on your career path. I was fortunate enough to have two great mentors, Glenn and Les Charles, who created Cheers. They taught me pretty much everything I know about writing and about running a comedy show. Three, uh, three weeks after David Lee and I were hired at Cheers, we had a crisis of confidence. We were convinced we were in over our heads and not good enough to write for the show. We walked into Glenn and Les's office and said we'd save them the trouble of firing us, we were resigning. If they had said okay and let us walk away from Cheers, my career would have looked very different. So thank you for their great mentoring and saying, are you nuts? So now your journey begins, just as mine did many years ago in Cox Stadium, only hopefully none of you are wearing a god-awful polyester, big-colored disco shirt like I was. My parting advice to you is find your passion and go after it. Remember, it's better to shoot for the stars and miss than aim for the gutter and hit it. Thank you.